walk longer than they used to. What does that mean? Well, the first thing it means is that we're spending about $100 million a day on prescription drugs. That's big. Mm -hmm. But the other interesting thing that it means, as people start to get into their 80s and 90s, we pick up some things that we didn't know much about before, dementia and Alzheimer's. Is there a better way? Is aging optional? I believe it is. Now we talk about those standard type diseases. Well, there's two more. Not well known. The first one is procrastination. Now, you, you might laugh at that, but Napoleon Hill in his book, 17 Principles of Success, indicates that 90% of the population has this disease. The other one is AADD. In Tim Ferriss's book, The Four Hour Body, now you have to like a title, The Four Hour Body. <laughs> He said, just a tiny little throwaway comment. Many people are avoiding taking adventures. And that is causing problems. Let's deal with the first one. Procrastination. Did you know that one of the cures for procrastination is being a member of Toastmasters? <laughs> <laughs> Well, it is. But do you know there's one other thing that Toastmasters gives? Bill Lawrence gave a talk one time, and I still remember. He was in charge of the research at the Ministry of Health. And he said, we talked about stop smoking, do exercise, eat healthier, to live longer. He said, our research is clear. Social support structures has a greater implication on longevity. What does Toastmasters do? You've got your social support structure. What does Toastmasters do for procrastination? Lance Miller at the International <coughs> Conference said very clearly, we talk about retaining membership. He said, we have to think about completions. What do you mean completions? Manual completions. And if we're going to think about manual completions, we'll be overcoming procrastination. In Helverson's book, Succeed, she said, I attended a lecture one time that had a profound influence on me deciding to become a behavioral psychologist. They had a group of students going home at Christmas. And they said, would you write how you spent Christmas Day? And would you hand it in so we can compare how people spend Christmas Day now and how they spend it in the past? This, by the way, is how to overcome procrastination. That's where I'm leading you to right now. Half of the group were taken aside. And they were asked, would you write down where you will be and what time it will be when you write this report? That's all. That was the only intervention. When it was time for the report to be Put in, and this was before email, so they had to deliver it. 30% <laughs> of the first group had it in. The astounding part is 70% of the second group had completed the assignment. Toastmasters gives you that opportunity to overcome procrastination. Adult Adventure Deficit Disorder is an interesting one, and I remember where it really hit me. My buddy, was, I was talking to him in Hawaii, he said, you want to go for a walk or a hike? I said, oh, sure, no problem. 
Uh, I said, when? Oh, he said, May. Oh, I said, but a year away. He said, yeah, a year away. So I had lots of time to get prepared. <laughs> I said, where? Well, he said, you fly into Madrid. I went, fly into Madrid? I'm thinking I might go for a hike in Hawaii. <laughs> That's when I found out the power of walking. In Deutsch's most recent book, The Brain That Heals Itself, because he wrote the first book on brain plasticity, walking creates new pathways in your brain and absolutely can turn Parkinson's aside. It can fend off dementia. Those big diseases with one thing, walking. And his fans' book, Evolve Your Brain, Change Your Mind, he said we need to have adventure and exploration because that also creates new pathways. If you only look for one prescription, it would be walking. I said $100 million a day spent on prescription drugs. Many we don't know if they're working or not, and many are creating side effects. <clears throat> John F. Kennedy had a great quote, and I'm going to change it. <laughs> Ask not what the healthcare system can do for you. Ask what you can do for your own healthcare. And the prescription is walking to change your brain. Toastmasters to improve your brain. 